Well, we came from the, the Big Bang. However, also in my latest book, uh, Physics of the Future, I talk about the next 50 to 100 years in technology. For example, the Internet will be in our contact lens, so we will simply blink and we will go online. And I, when I see you, I will see your biography right next to your name. And if you speak to me in Chinese, I will see subtitles right beneath your name. So I will always know who I'm talking to and what I am looking at. Also, cars will drive themselves. Cars will use GPS, lasers inside the fender, and they will drive themselves. And even paper will become intelligent. Your wallpaper in the future will become your wall screen. You'll be surrounded 360 degrees in your living room by an intelligent screen so that whenever you want to see a doctor or a lawyer, you simply talk to the wall and boom, an animated figure of a doctor or lawyer appears who answers all your medical and all your legal kinds of questions. And so with computer power doubling every 18 months, we're going to be living in something like the matrix. That is, we will see an imaginary world every time we want to. We'll simply blink and we'll be able to see uh, fantastic sights. College students will love it because they'll simply blink and see all the answers to their final examinations as they take their final examinations. It's important because the future is here today and jobs, the economy, are changing very rapidly. And that's why young people have to be able to get accustomed to the new technology or else they're going to be left behind. And so that's why Canvas Party is very important because the world economy itself is making a tremendous change. Definitely. I think uh, we're having a whole new generation of young people that are getting excited, that see that this is their future. This is where jobs are going to come from. It's where the economic growth will come from. Science is the engine of prosperity. And therefore, if you want to know what's happening next in the economy, you have to look at science. Science gave us steam power, the locomotive, the engine. Science gave us electricity, the space program. Science gave us lasers and computers. And now science will give us, in the future, nanotechnology, artificial intelligence, and biotechnology. Well, let me say that um, the future is here, and the challenge is right in front of us. That's why we have to inspire young people. That's why we have to get them on board. Some people say, I can't learn this. It's, it's, I'm, I'm too old for this stuff. Well, young people know that this is their future. And if the future is a train coming down the, down the railroad track, some people say, I'm too old. I'm going to lie down and get run over by the train. Young people say, get me on that train. I want to be in the driver's seat. I want to take control of my own future. And that's what Campus Party is all about.